the world is so vast and we are a part of it. Roughly, the planet is our land, but not everybody has the same definition. For some, the land is just ground. For others, land means nation or country. But the land can also be something spiritual and cultural. For example, the indigenous people, their land is sacred. It's the soil where their ancestors have lived. So the land represents something bigger for them. But the real question today is what does the land mean to me? First, we could start by how I'm arrived here. I'm from Europe, just here, La France. And to be exact, I'm from Troyes, a wonderful city where we produced champagne. You see, it's me, when I was young. I was already dressed to leave the land I was born for the land I'm here now. Canada. But even if I live here, France is my land because I grew up there surrounded by my family. My mom and my dad are both French. They educated me with their French values. I grew up here with my brothers, my cousins, and my friends. I wore proudly the flag of my land when I was playing football. What a beautiful place to live, a country with so many people and history. But for me, the land is not only physical, it's something cultural. Your gastronomy? A good memory, a flag, a monument, or even a motto, and it's your responsibility to share your culture with others. You also have to travel, your land is not something static, you can increase it by adding pieces of culture from other countries. I'm French, and if you ask me where I come from, my answer would be the same every time. But I'm also a little part of every place where I passed. And there is still so many lands to discover. The world is in our hands and the future remains to be determined. Where you come is your land, but not only, it's also in your mind. Mine is friends and will stay friends, but no, Canada are also a part of my land.